Hi, this is Math Globe. In the figure shown, if all the side lengths are integers and the sum of the area of four squares is 2019, then what would be the area of the red rectangle? Let the solution come. Now, let's check what we have. We have four squares with integer side lengths, and with a total area of 2019. So what we need, is to find the area of the red guy there, with the given data. Okay, let's start by giving names X and Y, to two smallest squares sides. Alright next, let's go ahead and name all the sides accordingly using these names. Well right after having completed naming all the sides, then let's move on, and write the area equations for each square up here. Next, we add the area equations up, which is equal to the total area 2019. Alright people, let's play around with the equation a bit. After expanding the brackets, and performing some reductions and multiplications as shown, we'll get this resulting equation. Okay. Let's solve this equation for y. To get the y alone on the left side, we first need to subtract both sides by the x squared and then, take the square root of both sides of the equation. Now let's take a closer look to the radicand. Because the radicand here cannot be negative, the x must be smaller than 38.4. Keeping in mind that y length must be bigger than the x, and they both must be integers, we can easily figure out that the value of x must be 11. So when we solve the equation for the value of x, we find the value of y 12. Now the easiest part, in order to calculate the area of the red rectangle, all that is left for us to do is, to find out the lengths of its sides, and multiply them together. The result will be 11. <laughs>